Hey, need some Madden coins? Check out CheapMaddenCoins.com. They got the best prices, they got fast delivery, and 24-7 custom support. Be sure to use code TEXAS at checkout for a 10% discount. Yo, it's Adam from Texas, but now one here. We just got back, and I still sound awful. Had a fun vacation out in Los Angeles. You guys should see a blog up on Gut Fox channel pretty soon about some Mutt 19 stuff that you guys might be interested in. So go ahead and check that out. Link down in the description below. Also, while you guys are here, hit the subscribe button, hit that bell button because we're gonna be going hard in Madden 19. You guys don't wanna miss out on anything. So hit that bell button as well as check out me on social media because I, I'm, I'm not doing any vlogs. I brought the camera, but I'm not doing any vlogs. Everything you guys wanted to see is gonna be on my Twitter or on my Instagram. So go ahead and check me out at those two locations. But today we got something that I'm going to probably get a lot of flack for, which is we have a use now for the Mutt Master Sean Taylor collectible that some of us have had since like September. Like, what did I get mine? Let's go to newest and let's go to collectible and hit X. See, when did I first get this Sean Taylor thing? So, we got Sean Taylor 11 20. So, we got him in November. We got ours in November. And it is what? June 13th. So, yesterday was June 12th. It took them, what, six months? to give us something to use for this collectible. Now, I'm, I'm excited that it's a golden ticket, but I'm not playing Madden in July. So, like, I'm getting a card that I'm only gonna be using for, I guess, 17 more days? And I really was hoping it could be something better. When we had Jake Stein on the podcast, I was like, please don't be collectibles, for, such as loyalty tokens and stuff for Madden 19. At this point, I would take that. Like, I would take that right now, mostly because it's a golden ticket. Even though it is free, I can choose whichever one I want is we got like like less than two months to new Madden comes out, man. So, all right, enough complaining. Let's go ahead and pick the guy that we want. Now, there's a couple of choices, obviously, that are like players you should pick and players you shouldn't pick, obviously. Like that, that, that what, LT linebacker? No, nah, if anybody picks him, bro, you're either a huge Chargers fan or you have a lot of coins that you don't really want. Well, no, because even at that point, he's going for not, he ain't going for that much. You're going to sell off a... The one you, I don't know, it's, I don't, I ain't making no sense right now. It's, I'm, I'm still, the, the, the sun out there melts in my brain. But just don't get LT, that's what I'm trying to say. Don't get LT. Cunningham, a guy that is also not a coveted quarterback, most because he already has a 98 that's out. He does have two chemistries and two abilities, but again, cards are already out there. It's like right there, Randy Moss, wide right receiver. Fast, but not great, in my opinion. Now, Shazier is interesting. The thing about him is, if I did not have as many linebackers as I do, he would be a guy I'd pick up because he, he's fast at 97 speed, great user, but I got Ray Lewis and I got my man Luke Keekley, I got Telvin Smith, and so at the linebacking core, I don't have a need for him, even though I still may go out and pick him up. My defensive line and linebacking core is stacked. Right here we got Michael Vick, quarterback, good quarterback to pick up right there. Marlon Humphreys tried this guy out. His impact blocking is kind of lacking and talking to Gut Fox about this dude, He's a beast card, but the one thing I'm not a big fan of is that I run a lot of cover three, and he does not block shed in cover three as well as he does in cover two. I could change up my defense, run from cover two, but no, I'm, I'm running cover three. That's pretty much been my whole thing the entire year. Not going to deviate from us tomorrow. Hopefully, it's not who we're picking up. Randy Moss might be that guy. He might be that guy, but... I'm powering up Richard Sherman, which will probably be the next video or the video after that. So Randy Moss, even though he can get 99 speed and he is six foot four, I don't have any room for my cornerback in core. Cause at this point, I'm already kind of invested in the cornerbacks I got. So I gotta go ahead and power up Sherman. I have to, like I gotta finish out what I started. And while Randy Moss would be a hell of a golden ticket to pick up cause he's going for 2 million coins and he'd be a great user, I got to pick up six foot three Sherman, who's not going to be as fast. I think he's with 95 speed. <laughs> That's I'm, I'm making a terrible decision. I know I am making a terrible decision. We got Terrell Pryor. We have Christian McCaffrey, Trubisky, Calvin Johnson, free safety, Deshaun Watson, Dawkins, Lamar Jackson, Fuller, Donald Cam, Juju, LT, and Roby. All right. So if I didn't have Von Miller, I would pick up Larry Floyd because he is tall as hell and he's fast and he would be a great user. But I got Von Miller. Roby is a dope cornerback as well. Quincy Wilson could have been great. I talked to the guy that made this card. He wasn't trying to listen to me. I was like, yo, you get this card, do these things. He's like, I already submitted the form. 
I'm like, well, why'd you hit me up? <laughs> I'm like, bro, this could have been an amazing quarterback, but you decided not to listen to me. I'm glad for the originality that you chose somebody that you like, but a card could have been better. Juju be clean as well at wide receiver, but doing a Richard Sherman set, we're going to get my man Jarvis Landry. Juju's not needed. So pretty much, it only leaves two cards that I pretty much could pick up for the roster. Post down in the comment section below who you guys are going to be choosing as your free golden ticket or who you already chose. Man, I should pick Randy Moss, but like, look at this card. I should pick him. Like, he honestly is the best choice. If you guys are trying to struggle, who do you want to pick up? Randy Moss is the best choice. He's 99 speed. He's a six foot four cornerback. You're not going to find much better than that. He has what, high block shit. He probably has high hit power. Like, you're not going to see many better guys than this. Like, yo, this is an amazing card. I just don't have any use for him right now. I do not have any use for him on my team once I do my Sherman guy. And so because of that, we're just going to go ahead and choose this golden ticket, Lamar Jackson, even though I know for a fact we'll get a better quarterback in the near future. So Lamar Jackson, welcome to the team. And we are not done with the upgrades right now. We got more to go on offense and defense. Check out the next video on my channel, which will be live later on today. And hopefully this decision I made does not come to bite me in the ass. I'm pretty confident though, every weekend league game I play, I'm gonna see Randy Moss. And I'm gonna see how good he is. And I'm gonna see Lamar Jackson not be able to escape the pocket and not be able to make the throws I wanted to make. I'm gonna be really mad that I didn't take him. But until that day happens, I think I'm content with the guy I chose. Again, post it down in the comment section below who you guys chose for your free golden ticket. And hopefully next year with the Mutt Match Collectible, we actually get a plan for what it's gonna be used for. I'm a big fan of when they decide to put the Mutt Master Collectible in, let's say, What's the, what I'm talking about? The Ultra Master set, and you get the Ultra Master collectible, you put that into the Grandmaster. I'm more of a fan of that. I don't really want them to give us a collectible and then not have a plan for it uh, for so from September. So like what, that's eight months, nine months? We went nine months not knowing what their plan was for the Ultimate or the Master Collective, which is fucking tragic. So next year, EA, be better, have a, have a roadmap. And follow that roadmap and let us know early on what this is going to be used for. And hopefully we get a better Mutt Master program next year. Because this year, you know, it was more inclusive. I still think Madden 16 and Madden 17, even Madden 15, is much better than what we got this year. You guys may disagree with me, but that's how I feel. It's me, your boy Texas. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.